Well, it's overcast Wednesday, about 10 o'clock, about 50 degrees. I don't know if it's, uh, I didn't check the forecast, but it looks terrible. Right over there, where they tore one of those houses down, they're getting ready to put in 97 wood pilings, foundation pilings. That's that last house they tore down, the fishing tackle guy's house. Hear the crane running, they're getting ready to drive pilings in a minute. When I was in the crane business, that was my buddy. His name is Garbarino. He's a local pile driver guy for a little, small, you know, house foundation pilings. Not a big giant guy. Little crane, little pilings. Air steam hammer. Can't make a. Twenty cent off a gallon. <coughs> Kroger. A local store here close by. You buy your groceries, you get gas points. We got up to 40, but I only use 20 of them. I got uh, $28 worth so far. 14 gallons and rolling. I was a little bleak on fuel. Yeah. You want a turkey sandwich? Yeah. Well, I got my four restaurant knives done. I got the hatchet done. I got the Air Force survival knife finished. I don't know if you can see that spot I showed you with this camera, but I'll take a close-up. It says 1968-something. And hold on a minute. If I put my glasses on, right here, glasses, you see, I can see now. It says something hunting sheathed survival pilots. Something... Jamalis Cutlery Company. That's all I can make up. I'll take a picture of that too. Okay, and all the other knives are done. The cut codes and the scissors and that whole flock of knives I had from that lady yesterday. I gotta take them back in a few minutes. Okay, Dougie, I'll get back to you. Thursday and I got this giant processor blade thing. Stacks up on that three high. Looks like a what do you call those things? Those copters they fly around now. Rotocopters or quadcopters. That's what it looks like. <laughs> it's a piece of work. It weighs about 15 pounds. Well, there it is. All sharpened. I gotta clean it up a little bit. Bad taquito right there. Bad taquito. I gotta hurry. I'm in the pulling business. Now I'm in the, this kind of business. She's in that kind of business. Chain. Oh, glory. Can't what? Pull it back off the dress, it's too heavy. Mac is a nice sharpening and a stump removal. I gotta get some new cars made up, I guess. Look at that spider looking thing. <laughs> That's that pyrocantha that was hiding over here.
and one big root. The rest of them are dead. Well, I got no reports from Nada. I guess everybody stayed home with the weather like it is. I might be uh, somewhat knife free tomorrow unless something changes. I may uh, I may get out for a spin myself. We'll see how it goes. Right, Davy Scooter? Where are you going? You want a nap? Everybody's taking a damn break. Including me. Look at Big Boo Boo over there. He's just sunning in his chair. Just getting ready to come on. Tombstone. <laughs> Val Kilmer plays Doc Holliday. This is a good movie. I'll see y'all later. Well, I spoke too soon. As soon as I turned the TV on, the volume and everything, I heard my phone beep. The mumbles man did go to the land of Nada today. Get that damn wind out of there. He found a bunch of clad, a blinger at the top, a whole gang of damn pennies, two zippers, a little Jimmy Junkie bracelet and a key. Now that's a lot of digging right there. It looks like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen or fourteen quarters, three, six, nine, about a dozen, thirteen dimes. Look like 10 or 11 nickels. Great googa mooga. Look at all them pennies. That'll send you to the recliner ran right there. That's a, <laughs> that's a productive day in the land of Nada right there. Okay. I've got fired up now. <laughs>